Welcome to This Is Important, a production of iHeartRadio, the show where we only talk about what's obviously most crucially integral to the fabric of our very nature. Today we talk about... If we're not talking about jerking off, Kyle's checked out. My man has a man nest back there. These are butt cheeks. This is butt cheeks. I'm definitely not inside of the butthole. John Smith, he found some like golden plates that said like, this shit is important and it it led to our podcast. Here we go. (laughs) Hey, hey, hey. (sighs) It's been it's been a while. It's been a minute since I've been up in it. Damn, baby. A lot of wind up for that one. Ow. Woo. Are we feeling good, baby? <laughs> feeling good? You guys see the size of this Jack and Coke? I'm actually, I'm actually a little. Uh... Let's get it started in here. Ooh, ooh, I like that. Thanks, Blake. <laughs> yeah, you got it. <laughs> that hits. That hit a note. Keep, keep running, running, and running, running, and running, running, and running, running. Yeah, dude. Oh, Adam knows. Oh, that's Fergie? Is that Fergie? Adam, uh, yeah, it's Fergie. It's Fergie. Fergie. Do you have her? <laughs> yes, thank you. Back when music was good in the early aughts, okay? Play yeah, Ferg again? Yeah. Fergie. Do you have her national anthem by oh. any chance? <laughs> oh, I wish I did. I don't have that. <laughs> I dream, I dream. Whoa, oh, no wonder. No wonder. wonder. And did you feel the flavor of the... Fever of the flavor when you were there? Do I feel the fever of the flavor? Uh, No, what sucked is that was the all-star game that I weirdly did a dance. We've talked about this on the podcast. Mm -hmm. Right. With like... We've talked about everything on the podcast. We're tapped, okay? Durs Durs wants you to touch on it Ludacris. We've... Yeah. yeah. I'm just touching. I'm just touching. You hung with Luda? Is that right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Yeah, I was like, I shared a dressing room with uh, Ludacris. He's like, yo, what music do you want to listen to, Adam? And I go, "Uh, anything by word of mouth? (laughs) And he just looked at me and goes, no. I'm like, oh, okay. Um, He probably is like, I've heard that album enough, dude. (laughs) Yeah. I made mm-hmm. it. It's all good. Yeah, it's like, I'm good. I'm good with that. No. And, and then I suggested uh, the Pitch Perfect 2 soundtrack. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and he right. said, wow. yeah, baby. <laughs> this, and then he said, hell yeah. I like that. Let's get it started. <laughs> wait, what? Ha. So wait, but in the room, okay? Because this is like a viral thing. And I walked out directly after the, <laughs> like hearing the end of it and being like, oh, that seems like a... Like she's going for it. And right. then just seeing like security guards' faces. I didn't see her. And then I just saw like security guards' faces being like, <laughs> <laughs> fuck was that? Yeah. Uh, and people like kind of laughing and snickering. And then it wasn't until after the game that I, I saw all the um, mm-hmm. the hoopla. Hey, Luda, why don't you put something on? Mm-hmm. Please don't stop the, please don't stop the, please don't stop the music. Whoa, needle drop. <laughs> Disturbing the peace. Please don't stop the music. Wow. Quick with the needle drop on it? Wow, man. Yeah, good job, Blake. Good searching Thank and all you. that stuff, man. Well done. Yeah, dude. That was really good. Really good, Blake. Dude, that hits. I need that for the board, I think. How'd you find that? That's How'd you find man. that so fast? That's a quick find. Uh, well, whenever you want me to sing it, I could <laughs> I could sing it. I could do the whole dance, dude. I have that one. That one is seared into the memory. <laughs> please, please don't do the dance. You'll <laughs> die. Your hips will explode. You will die. You'll split into two people. Well, yeah, true. <laughs> Please don't do the dance, Adam. <laughs> uh, the live tour is going to start in like a few weeks. Um, yes. We'll do it live. We'll do it live. <laughs> oh, dude, the good live. Hey, that's funny. We'll do it. Fuck it. We'll do it live. We'll do it when live. When does this episode, uh, producers, when does this episode air? I think next week. I think we'll next week. We'll do it live. Yeah, so we're we're just a few weeks out from the live podcast where I guarantee you I'm going to sing that song. <laughs> In its entirety, mm-hmm. every show, every goddamn show. Adam's gonna dance and his leg is gonna pop off. That's how I'm opening up my segment of the podcast. We'll do it live. Like the like the orange dudes from the labyrinth that's just gonna hop away. Oh yeah, dude. 
Is on its own, pull it off and throw it in the audience. Oh man, the f- are those guys? Hey, are those guys called fireies? Is that what they're called? Or what are, do you know what? Like the fire guys? Yeah, what are they called? Mm, that sounds derogatory, but <laughs> I think it's the fire guys. Uh, whoopsies! <laughs> I thought they were Blake. Will look it up. He's so fast at Google because he's so young. Because don't they say like <laughs> we'll do in the live. song like don't they say like chili down like chili down with the fireies? Maybe. Uh, like, don't they say that? Yeah, maybe. down with the fireies. I want to say they say it over and over again. Well, love. Yeah, baby. Well, love. Scary moment in a movie, <laughs> that one. Great char- great characters. Oh, when they take the heads off and... Not supposed to be scary, but like kind of gets a little too turnt in a weird way when you're young. Yeah. You're like, oh, these guys are funny. And then they're like, hey, lady, give me your head. And she's right. like, ah. They're, yeah, they, they're, they're a little handsy. They are yeah. a little handsy. Oh, that's right. They fucking try and take her head off. Like, that's scary, dude. Yeah. Yeah. And their eyes come out of their mouth and stuff. That shit's weird, dude. And clothes? They try to take her clothes? Her, her clothes. And her clothes. Yeah, it gets weird. It gets really weird. I'm going to wear your bra on my head. <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm pretty sure they do. Uh, well, oh, we- no. Blake's got a... Maybe when Adam watches it for the first time, we can we can double check it. Has Adam never seen? Because he, because you've never seen it, Adam. You've never seen Labyrinth. What's up? You weren't there in Santa Monica when we I've, saw that shit in the theater, and like we saw the owl and stuff. I feel like, oh my god, oh my god, dude. I'll we we can circle back to that. Go ahead, Adam. <laughs> That's it. Let's go, dude. I feel no. I was not there. I never saw it in a theater. I feel like I saw it once, and I think I was very young, and being like, nah, this this ain't for me. <laughs> this ain't it. Back to back to back to my ducktails. Uh-huh. Yeah. yeah, it didn't click for you. God, that clicked so hard with me and Blake and Durs. No, a lot of people didn't. Yeah, but I did hear that a lot of people didn't like that movie. It was a little too creepy. It's with David Bowie. He has kind of like a huge cod piece. It's it's weird. Well, yeah, David Bowie, I feel like, and this is why I can't get that into David Bowie, because I just want to fuck him the whole time, you know? He's too sexy. <laughs> well, that was his whole, that was his whole steez. <laughs> That's part of why you watch, right? Isn't that why you watch it, though? You're like, I want to fuck this guy. Yeah, but I don't, see, I, I don't want to, I don't want to fuck him. Right. You don't even want to be married man. Right. Okay? I don't want to fuck David Bowie. Right. Yeah, but we're and just. And when I was a kid, I was like, these are feelings that I don't know and I'm not familiar with. But what if he offered to dip you headfirst into the bulk of eternal stage? <laughs> okay. Well, it's a good, oh. it's a banger. And uh, yeah, Jennifer Lawrence. It. No. <laughs> no, not Jennifer Lawrence. Jennifer. Uh, oh, Jennifer oh, Connelly yeah. is, she's unreal. Jennifer Lawrence. Jennifer uh, Connelly of of maverick fame <laughs> is in it and um and what's the aronofsky movie that she's in top gun maverick not maverick with uh mel gibson correct no not that's not right. maverick with mel gibson that's jodie foster because that one's pretty that one's pretty good too not bad <laughs> requiem no. she's in requiem too that's right Mel had some good movies, and then <laughs> is David Bowie still alive? Should we get him uh, to come? No, Adam. No, Adam, no. David no. <laughs> is David Bowie dead? He he has passed away. Yeah, Adam. Yeah, yeah, man. Ah, <laughs> oh, that sucks. I was I was gonna get him to come to our show in Medford, Massachusetts. Do you remember when the world mourned? <laughs> yeah, dude. He was gonna be first. He was coming. No. <laughs> he was gonna be our first guest in Chicago, Illinois, on September seventeenth. Followed by Phoenix, Arizona, Long Beach, Denver, St. Louis, Cleveland, Go Columbus, Indianapolis, <laughs> we'll Louisville, Atlanta, yes. Salt Central. Lake City, Utah, yes. and Seattle. And those are just the dates that we're talking about right now. We're doing live. Right. So yeah. Adam just listed a <laughs> gang of bangers that we're going out to. Yeah. But that's like I guess half the tour dates. I guess so that's half. About yeah. half. If you're in Texas. Just fucking yeah. get out of my Dude. DMs and stop telling me that we're, we're making a mistake not going to Texas. We're going to Texas. Well, it makes me... Uh, it, dude, it, and guess what? Guess what? We're going to Texas. Now I don't want to go to Texas. What? Now Texas... Yeah, now... Wait, but this is, the, this is the beauty of the podcast. Huh? He's going to bring that fury. Don't draw the lines. Don't draw the lines. Don't draw lines. I don't want to go to Texas. From the... From the amount of hate that Texas gave us, I was like, mm-hmm. well, maybe maybe I'm not going to Texas now. What the maybe hell? Get- no, that's not hate. It's excitement. It's like, come on, man. They're, they're- exactly. I believe it's called fervor. It's fervor, man. It's the fervor. fervor storm is building. 
its fervor. Dirt has brought a word out. Okay. Yeah, maybe maybe you're right. Maybe you're yeah, right. That's, but it, it's the, just, that's Texas fervor. Well, you know, yeah. I just dealt with a lot of fervor myself online uh, with Marvel. Uh uh oh. I I I the whole Marvel thing that I talked about in the podcast a few weeks ago. Mm-hmm. Right. Evidently the the uh, for whatever reason Variety and Deadline Hollywood and and all these publications mm-hmm. yeah. uh just said that they, it, it was a slow news day and my statement about Marvel was just went out there and Marvel fans my god man. Well, I think do they Adam, get the I fervor think... with them is unreal. It's like they all I... owned Marvel. Like they were all the owner of Mark. I don't disagree. I think what happened was you had said it and then it went away and Mm. then you brought it back up on the podcast, Mm. which came out. And that's Mm. why it came back with such fervor. I think that's how it got picked up again. Because people were like, oh, he's still talking about it. Well, no, because then they would have used, then they would have used fervor our podcast and not Theo Vaughn's podcast when referencing it. Yeah, damn, that would have been a good... That would be getting put good press. Do. Yeah, but Theo Vaughn's got like way more listeners. Yeah. Like that bitch. <laughs> now this fervor, this fervor word that we're using so often, Durst, did you know this word or did you just look this up? And also, can somebody please tell me what it means? You don't know what the word fervor means? <laughs> I don't. I don't believe I've... It's You're like hollabaloo. Yeah. It's like excitement. <laughs> it's just, yeah. It's fervor. It's hollabaloo. It's excitement. It's... um. Oh, hollabaloo. Hollabaloo. <laughs> hollabaloo? Wait, you're using hollabaloo to explain what fervor is? I don't know if fer- <laughs> fervor and hollabaloo are the same. Yeah, hollabaloo, ho- to hollab- me, means... <laughs> hollabaloo is like a big hoopla, right? Isn't it like a hoopla? Yeah, yeah it just means like uh, a bunch of stuff is happening. None of this is helping. <laughs> hollabaloo yeah. is like a, a big fuss, a big mess. <laughs> yeah, it's a yeah. hoopla. And fervor... Yeah, like a bunch of stuff is... Fervor uh, is like intensity. Co- fervor can cause a hollabaloo. Yeah. yeah. Oh, so fervor's the buildup. Fervor's the. Oh yeah, I've seen fervor start hollabaloo. Oh, fervor yeah, is right. edging. Fervor is edging. It's uh, the edge, right? Is that what that is? Um. Yeah. It's like. An... <laughs> I don't know what you're searching, pal. <clears throat> <laughs> I'm a dumbass. Uh, <laughs> this dude is on. Uh... Fervor is like e- edging. Yeah, it's like edging. Like the buildup. The buildup. Excitement. Yeah. It's yeah, yes. the build up. Yeah, okay, all right. And I'm I'm catching your ferv. Oh, I see what you're saying. Like hedging, like the build up. Yeah, like sure. Okay, cool. Good. Huh. <laughs> He's speaking in cum tongue. Yeah, Kyle only uh, can understand words if it relates to jerking off. <laughs> if it's a Pornhub category, he's well, like, I just want it when I'm with. Yeah. Wait a second, is that like ATM or like what are we saying? I don't, when so, I'm with you three, I absolutely need to distill it down to that. Yeah, I think right, that's like, kind of important, right? Like hullabaloo is kind of like when how, you're really squanching on your nuts. <laughs> Is this like a finger in your ass or what is this? Yeah. No, is yeah. that would be hoopla. Yeah. Is this like a white one in the male, pink, two Asian in the hoopla. female POV? <laughs> two in the hoopla. That's all the blue. Wait, so Blake, when you masturbate, you put two in the pink, and where is your pink exactly? In the hoopla. <laughs> Hullabukaki. It's in the hullabaloo. It's in the hub rub. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, while I'm fervoring my testicles, it's mm. very good. <laughs> We're back! <laughs> Hello. We're back. Dude, we never left. <laughs> Hey man, <laughs> that's right. We did never leave. Yeah. We never please left. Don't stop the, please don't stop the. Please don't stop the music. <laughs> bop, 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 bop. God um, damn. We didn't go anywhere, baby. <laughs> please don't stop the music. I would back you up on that, dude. Get ready, Massachusetts. That's got to be the track we come out to. It's getting late, making my way over to the favorite place. What if we did the bop? Bop, Nobody bop, let Kyle bop, talk. Bop, 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 Nobody bop. let Kyle talk. You want us to acapella? Okay. <laughs> I want us to back at him. Nope, not going to happen, Kyle. <laughs> Gotta get my body moving, shake the stress away. Why? Kyle, I would love that. Yeah. I would love to Nobody. really, um, You, we're going to have a lot of downtime, you know, when we're <laughs> in these different cities. Sure. And instead of going out and exploring the cities. Oh, I love that. I say me and you stay in the hotel room together. You know I'm down with that, bro. You know I'm down with that. Smoke weed. Don't see an inch of any city we're in and just practice acapella. Except for a pickleball. 
except for pickleball. I do need to play pickleball <laughs> and <laughs> practice acapella. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh, and Adam is leaving the conversation. <laughs> mm, no. yeah, yeah. yeah, maybe not. Yeah, that's it. I'm just being real with you. Uh, Kyle. Adam, I do want you to record. <laughs> I can't. I can hardly walk. So pickleball's out for me. No, for me. I want you to record those videos where like you sing part of it and then you sing the other part of it. And then it's like different boxes of you all doing it. I, d I did that. He literally did that. did that. You did that? For Bumper. Yes. I did that for Bumper in Berlin. When Bumper <laughs> took his travels to Berlin. You can't talk about it. Well, that I know. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's, wow, that's a huge dude. part of the very first episode. So <laughs> yeah, tune in. Yeah. I saw it. Well, not yet. Wait till the strike's over, then tune in. All right. <laughs> um, right. Yeah. Kyle, why don't you like go city to city and challenge people? Like, put like a bunch of money on pickleball games. Like, play like one thousand dollar games. Down, down. Or have people pay to play you? Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Dude, I'm down. Oh yeah, that's a good idea too. That's a good idea. Ooh. And donate a percentage to charity Ooh. yes sir so it's like white men can't jump but since white men are like the only people playing pickleball uh <laughs> right oh right <laughs> because they can't jump it's like white men can can't jump so they play pickleball <laughs> yeah yeah white men can't jump so they play pickleball that's the sequel that's, yeah. great. <laughs> that's great that's <laughs> great well wait didn't they just make the sequel to white men can't or like a reboot or whatever yeah and no one talked about it. Yes. They rebuilt it. it. Yes. Yeah, they rebuilt so it, it. It came and went like a fart in the wind. Uh -huh. I'm a little disappointed by how there's there's no staying power of movies anymore. Mm, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Let's get into it. Let's get into it. <laughs> Who's the guy in it? Jack Harlow? Is it Jack Harlow? Let's get it. Hollywood talk. Hollywood. It was uh, Jack Harlow. And then I, I don't know the other kid's name. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I just knew Jack Harlow. Jack Harlow might just, I mean, I'm not saying Woody Harrelson isn't cool. Right. But he was just kind of known as like a quirky guy. Whereas Jack yeah. Harlow's known as like the guy who will steal your girl, right? Like this right. dude is like. Is that, how, is that what Jack Harlow is to you? Well, he's pretty like smooth. Incredibly sexy. Rubs his hands yeah. together like Birdman. I feel like he's, he, yes. You know, which this has to stop, by the way. This that's Birdman hands. Birdman's allowed to do that. Birdman can do it. <laughs> is this just because people were putting uh like Birdman stuff on their it. hands, hand sanitizer for like <laughs> yeah, this during was, the pandemic? <laughs> it had a COVID comeback. The hand the ha money hands. <laughs> really? But yeah. dude, it has to stop. I thought it's like ready to chomp. Well, is that money hands? Is that what you said, Blake? That's not money hands. I thought it was a I thought it was like ready to chomp hands, no. isn't it? Yeah, cash. Like cash money. No, it's like get ready hands. Like money is like this. This that's like you're plotting. Like you're an evil. Adam, I like how your neck starts to work as soon as you do money fingers. He's doing money hands. He got the shoulders. He's doing a little shoulder lean. I don't think I don't. This isn't this. I can't do it really. No, I, it's not money hands. It's definitely like this is this is not money. This is it's more like this. This is the one I like. It's warming up your hands because you're about to go to work. I you're about to do some work with these hands. <laughs> yeah, this is chomp hands, bro. <laughs> I, you're, I think it's it's more like plotting. You're, it's plotting hands. No. You're but, plotting something. You're ready for a takeover. We're getting ready to fucking. No, this is eating you're... hands like. Mm, like. <laughs> oh, dude, they're, they re it represents no. fervor. No, it's not eating. These hands, these hands represent fervor. This is. But these are fervor hands. These are definitely. These are fervor hands. It's like a doctor who's about to check your testicles. He's like, let me just warm <gasps> them up so it's not shocking. <laughs> He's like, let me fervor those testicles. Dude, I, I just got my, uh, my uh, like a first physical since I was like 15 years old yesterday. Here we go. Yeah. And turns out. <laughs> what? I got your blood work. He, he, he like, he dropped, had me drop. You got a bunch of hoopla at the doctor? Oh. Yeah, I had a bunch of hoopla. <laughs> and he made me drop and he's just like checked out my nuts. And then he made me turn around and I thought I was about to get a finger in the ass. Yeah. Hullabaloo. He does not have gloves on. Hullabaloo. Oh, no, he does have gloves on. He does have gloves on. But I'm like, there was no lube or anything. I was like, is this man about to stick his finger up my ass? No, that's not how it goes down. And that's I, not how I, it goes down. He would never. I bend over the table thinking I'm gonna, about to get it. Were you like this before? Were you like this? 
a finger in my ass. I was doing the hand thing, uh-huh. and he just spread my oh, ass cheeks apart uh-huh. and just Hello. looks at my asshole. Yeah. Oh, okay. And goes, "You don't have to. You don't have to get your uh, your butthole fingered for another few years." Uh huh. Uh-huh. Doctor Brozarks. And then he just looked at my asshole for like a you know a few seconds, and then he was yeah. done. I'm like, what is he checking? I thought you were about to say minutes. <laughs> at least you didn't hear him whisper. Oh, that'll work. Mm. What did you say? He, he was going. Mm. I guess that's. I guess is that like. Hey, guys, let's let's mm. play Family Feud. What's the top five answers for worst things a doctor could say while he's staring at your asshole? <laughs> okay. Well, I mean, I, I guess like what are, what is he checking for? Like, what is an asshole? What are what am I checking like, for? They're checking for. I mean, Blake or Kyle will tell you fissures and hemis. Yeah, they're checking for hemis. They're oh. checking for fissures. They're probably checking for polyps. You know what I mean? Like some cancerous polyps. Now, what's a polyp? Jesus, you're poor asshole, Kyle. <laughs> what's huh? a polyp? You're poor asshole, dude. What is going on back there? This asshole pours. <laughs> I'm good. I'm good. It's just a. Th- it's a. Th- what's a polyp? A polyp is like uh, a growth. It's like a uh, like a bump in the. Oh yeah, no, that's like it's really important to find those, right? Because don't those develop into colon cancer? They can, they can, they can be. Yeah, those are very not in my butt. Colorectal <laughs> cancer, no sir. Yeah, you got to get your yeah. rectum tight. Yeah, so they're looking for any signs that says that they, if they're looking for they're looking for anything in there that's like you know what I should dig. Thankfully, they didn't see anything that was yeah. like. Yeah. <laughs> Why are you using two hands? Why are you using? There's just a little tongue. <laughs> we got a gaper. I'm looking in there because I'm like looking. <laughs> you know Adam, I mean? is that the butt cheeks or the butthole? Adam, yeah, I, I feel he didn't didn't spread. What else are we doing? Did you get on the treadmill for this guy? Like this was butt cheeks. These are butt cheeks. This is butt cheeks. I'm definitely not inside of the butthole. Okay. No, doing a lot of. Well, no, that's that's asshole that you're doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah you're really <laughs> gripping there. This this is cheeks, dude. I don't know. That's cheeks. Yeah, it was the cheeks. Cause of diarrhea. This is hole. Oh, like this, <laughs> like that. Just I like we're like we're, like we're becoming a very like visual that. podcast. It's less about yeah. the audio any anymore. Yeah, you gotta watch this one on YouTube. This. <laughs> Well, that's why you got to see us live. You got to see our hand gestures, our funny faces. We're trying to build fervor. It's, it's, it's you know. And please come out and see us live in, in live in Medford, Massachusetts, yes. which is outside of we'll Boston. Do it live. <laughs> Don't know English. Chicago, yeah. Illinois. Chicago. Phoenix, we'll Arizona. Live. Long Beach, California. Denver, Colorado. St. Wow. Louis, Missouri. You know, St. Louis was just uh, rated uh, most dangerous city. In we'll America. do it live. Hmm. Let's let's do it. Ah, we're, I also heard they have you know, something I read on the internet that could also not be true. I, don't I think know. they have really good pizza there, so let's get mm-hmm. in and barbecue. Yeah, they, they are. They do have good pizza. Are we going on a little barbecue? Saint Lunatics. Yes, yeah. we finally might yes. meet yeah. Nelly. Yeah, Saint. That's what I was thinking. Saint Lunatics, man. Should we all yes. wear band aids out? For sure, Nelly's coming. He's going to be the guest in in Saint Louis. Uh, oh. Cleveland, Ohio, Columbus, Ohio. Oh, should we mention that every show will not have a spe- special guest? <laughs> every show, no will show, definitely, probably not have a special guest. <laughs> no show <laughs> will have a special guest. None. Louisville, Atlanta, Salt Lake City, and Seattle. What do you think is going to be the most fun show of this first batch? Oh, oh. Will you name them all again three times? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, Medford, Massachusetts. We'll do it is live. The, is the first one. That's uh, Medford, dude. Medford I'm, goes off. Yeah, I'm thinking. Someone said to me. Well, I didn't know where it was. I was like, I thought we were going to Boston. Turns out it's just like a suburb of Boston. It's we'll just do it live. City. I bet they rep super hard. I bet it's gonna be That's cool. That's dope. Yeah. Suburbs we're... fucking rock, dude. Yeah, dude. Medford's mm-hmm. gonna fucking slay. Suburbs are the shit, man. Mm. Let's go to Medford. Yeah, that one might be. And I know Chicago's going to be off the charts. That's that's Jersey's hometown. You know we're going to. Yeah. Oh, dude, you know my city is finna show up <laughs> for me. Dude, I actually think the theater we're I think the theater we're doing is super sick. Like it's a pretty Yeah, large. the Chicago Theater. What? Is it the Chicago Theater? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's the one from mm-hmm. like uh 
the beginning of Perfect Strangers. I think. <laughs> Great pull, it- Durs. <laughs> oh, nice, dude. Or is it the beginning of uh, Siskel and Ebert? I can't remember. Yeah, dude. Yeah, it's yeah, the beginning disaster, of uh, my guy. What's the beginning of? Wait, what's the beginning of Siskel and Ebert? Uh, Durs, can you give us something from the 2000s, please, man? Some reference. No, Chicago had its time in the 80s, and then they kind of moved on. And everyone's like, but some of the Batmans were filmed here. Nobody knows that. Can't tell. They do now. You uh, put them on. I know that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I would love to shoot. And for more facts, come on out to the show live. <laughs> See me drop some factoids about movies from the 90s. I would love to shoot something in Chicago. They really, their mm-hmm. film industry. Uh, you can't actually say it. It's a film something, not shoot something, because they're doing film, that. Film <laughs> something, yes. <laughs> yeah. um, Chirac true. is what the kids are Yeah, calling. that's just got it. Drill uh, music. Is do they not have a big right. film uh, community there anymore, or they just don't give the tax benefits? Pro. Oh, it's bigger than LA. It's bigger than LA. <laughs> no, yeah, they're filming yeah. like all the Chicago fire shows. I was gonna oh, say Chicago true. Hope is probably still going off over there, right? I uh, hope so. so. Oh, oh, we can hope. We hope. What are points? Points. <laughs> points. points. Okay, good stuff. Points. Yeah, there are the Chicago shows, which I think are like four shows now. Like, cool. I could. I could. I guess. Um, yeah. yeah, there's a bunch of stuff filming there. What's the most legendary? All right, well, good. CSI Chicago. Is there a CSI? Yeah, I got to get my ass out there. Yeah. yeah. Bring more than your ass. Uh, Phoenix, Arizona. I mean, we've we've promoted oh. Game Over Man there, and that place is a... Oh, my God. Banger. Yeah, yeah, Arizona rocks. I did hear something about that theater. I heard Holy the dry Lord. heat. I heard that theater is in the round, which is kind of cool. Like it's okay. Oh yeah, the celebrity. That's a really cool theater. A lot of people uh, film their specials oh, there. A bagel. How are we gonna do that? What? And, <laughs> and I heard that it can rotate. Are you kidding me? Oh, we're gonna crank that bitch up. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> no, <laughs> no. I heard it can go around and around and around. How fast? Put it on full tilt after a few buzz balls? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, dude. We're fucking, that sounds dope, dude. That sounds like fun. <laughs> dude, just crank as fast as they could possibly spin it. We're just yeah. on a... <laughs> Holy, yeah. That would be yeah. so sick. Yeah. I'm happy to do that. Turn it up to 11. That, we, Gravitron, just do the show from a Gravitron? The dude who runs it's super serious. There's no 11. It's one to four. Okay. It goes to four. Yeah. It's, uh, it's, from, a, it's from a movie. Yeah. Is it from the 90s? No. Can't touch the 11. And then we go, when then we come back home to Long Beach. Oh, yeah. Mm. My alma mater. We'll do it live. Home yeah. of Cameron Diaz and Snoop Dogg. The, uh, the uh, Blake Anderson went to school there. Yep. Did you not, Blake Anderson? I did for about a year. And then we got workaholics. Yes. What's the mascot? Can we shout out the, the mascot? It's very important to me. 49ers. Yeah, but they were the their baseball team was the dirt bags. Dirt bags. I have a tank top. I will be wearing it at the live show. Be ready for that. Which is very yeah. cool. They still do. They still get. They still get away with that, or not that it's like a. Well, I think. A, I think a dirt bag is the is the base. Is the actual yeah. bit. I, I yeah, I get that. But I'm saying yeah. like the coochie. <laughs> the coochie is actually what they call the. Well, that's not what a dirt bag is. Short stop. <laughs> they can get away with it. It's We're fine. just the coochies. Uh, yeah. No, no I, but just I'm just saying. Like it seems like. I don't know if there's still dirt bags. Yeah, I get what you're saying. Like, like people are so offended by that, but it, you know. Yeah, they're like my uncle was a dirt bag. <laughs> right. <laughs> we come from a long line of dirt bags. Yeah, you can't say dirt bag. I can. Um, Fuck it. Yeah. Okay. Well, cool. That's very cool. And I, uh, I mean, that's that's cool that we're gonna be in Long Beach. I, I. Th- yeah. I haven't spent a ton of time in Long Beach. I, I've done the Laugh Factory there mm-hmm. a couple times, um, but. I'm, I'm excited to uh, to mess up Long Beach. Yeah, that's going to be fun. Yeah, I've been to a, f- a few Olympic trials there. Uh, okay. Um, saw a world record okay. set there, and I believe Let's 2004. Tickle. Who set the world record? Ooh. Shout out Ian Crocker and the Hunter Butterfly, 50 point. Of course, Ian Crocker. Something. Damn. Uh, and then we go to Denver, Colorado. And oh, shit. Denver, Colorado, I think might be the one. I think that might be. Looking at this list. That is a good call. I was just out there, and it's sick. I yeah. liked it. Yeah. Denver rocks. Dude, Denver fucking rocks. It's a great city. It's super clean. Uh, it's And that's all it takes for Adam to find. <laughs> I just love cleanliness. That's my main thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Yeah. Uh, and then I've never been to Denver. I don't think I've. Ever... <laughs> it's cute. It's hella tiny. It looks old, but but also feels new at the same time. More more. Uh, it's, it's it's the. I think it. I mean, I think this stat is. It's like the sunniest one of the sunniest places oh. in America. Yeah, dude. I love that. The Sunshine State. Yeah. The Sunshine State. Is is that what it's called? No, it's not. Wow, it's the sunniest <laughs> like place. It really? Yeah, it's it's. I thought it was Florida. I thought Florida is <laughs> a sunshine state. Well, we gotta switch them up, man. Global warming is changing everything. It is, but Southern California, I thought was the the tops for as far as sunny goes. But uh, I I almost went to school. It's the Golden State. Wouldn't at uh, Arizona. That's what it is. Yeah, California is a Golden State, and then Florida is a Sunshine State. Well, those are just names. Those are just fun nicknames. I'm... All righty then. But then what's what's Arizona? Isn't uh -huh. that the sunniest? No, that's the Roadrunner State. Hottest. That's the hottest. That's got to be the hottest state. Okay. You don't want that on a license plate, though. We're the hottest state. <laughs> what state is Arizona? This is, I like this game. I like state games. What is the Arizona, what kind of state is it? Well, you mean like. Denver is still one of the sunniest cities in America. <laughs> All right. Adam, what's the next city? <laughs> Wait, what do you mean, Blake? You mean like, what does it say on the license plate? I got you. Every state is the blank state. Arizona yeah. is what? The show me state. <laughs> Which one's no. show me the dick. Uh, that's, what's up with the show me state? What the fuck does that even mean? Well, you know what we're doing in Arizona then. But guys are coming on stage and they're going to show me their dick. <laughs> oh, show your buttholes. That's not Arizona. We'll do that in St. Louis, which is in the show me state. Oh, yeah. well, we're going to be showing a lot of dicks. Oh, okay. 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 Wait. We're going there. God, but to back up my good. point, my point was. Uh, you are so dumb. Denver is one of Perfect. the sunniest cities in America with an average of 245 sunny days per year. So. Oh, wow. Damn. Never would have thunk that. On average. Good mm. Lord. Uh, we It should be nice. And it's almost too much. Sunny when we're there yeah. in Denver on September 24th. And then we'll go to St. Louis. This is not the always sunny tour. It's <laughs> always sunny in Denver, Colorado. <laughs> we, we couldn't help it. We're, we'll juice up like Mark McGuire. Yeah, okay. And uh, and have a good time under the arch. Uh-huh. Then beautiful St. Louis. What other things do you guys know about St. Louis? In the show me state. Um, the show me state of Missouri. The show me state. That's the show me state, right? And what? I think it has a jazz scene. Okay, jazz is tight. Yeah, I don't know. The barbecue, just the St. Louis barbecue, no? Yeah? Yeah, barbecue. Yeah. St. Louis is known for barbecue. Uh, and the St. Lunatics. Yeah, that's enough. Yeah. The guy with the mask. Dude, Murphy Lee, that's a lot of stuff. Murphy Lee. We're only there for a couple yeah. days, right? Did we cover this this episode? No, just one day. I can't remember. <laughs> Did we already talk about the St. Lunatics? Okay, let's move on. Next <laughs> next one. Goodbye. In the arch. We got to go up the arch. And, and then we go to... Then we got... Uh, then we go to Cleveland, Ohio. Uh, Oh, Ooh, the mistake by Cleveland. the lake. I can't wait, baby. Oh, damn. That's so close. Oh, yeah. yeah. Cleveland rocks, according to Drew Carey. So Drew Carey. We got to get Drew Carey. Yeah. yeah. The dog pound. Let's go Browns. Bone thugs in harmony. Like, come on. Oh, yeah. Kid Cuddy, if you will. My goodness. Mm -hmm. Come on. OK. Oh, it's Cuddy from uh, Cleveland. Yeah. Did you dude. look at that. Yeah, I think it's a shaker. Shaker Heights guy, right? Huh? Dude, get your LeBron James jerseys on on. And we're not saying he's going to be there, but LeBron but... joining us. So. <laughs> yeah. yeah. We're not, we're not saying he's going to be there. LeBron. Him, him and Kid <laughs> Cudi are going to do a crazy thing. They met on the set of uh, the house party revamp. and uh, <laughs> LeBron. Let's just say. I did a night on that that got cut, and we'll see them all there. We're super tight and close now. We're sending out some texts. And were you? Uh, you got cut you? out of the rebuild of that movie? The the re reboot. It was like a during COVID. Like oh. they called me at like five o'clock and they're like, "Can you come downtown at nine thirty and film a scene?" And I was like, "Oh, I can remember." Okay, that. Yeah. sure. <laughs> they're like Le they're like LeBron James. I mean, I w I went and I was like, "Yeah, this is gonna get cut." It was like oh. the the dudes coming out of like an eyes wide shut party, super a ridge, mm -hmm. and um. Then I was just like there, like, hi. Shots fired. 
Here's yeah. your yeah. Gung -nay. Dude, you better be careful. It, it was notoriously horrible. Dude, the the house party fans <laughs> hive are gonna come after you just like the Marvel fans yeah, came after me, right. dude. You better be careful, dude. That's all right. The the guys were house party hive is vicious. <laughs> the fervor of the house party fans are gonna, are gonna get you. Be careful, yeah. man. So after Cleveland, Ohio, we're sticking in Ohio. We evidently mm. love the Buckeye State. Oh yes. Because we're going to Columbus, and I don't think I've ever been to Columbus. Ooh. Oh. So this is pretty exciting. I've been to every okay. other one of these cities so far. I love that. Shout out to the Columbus crew. Okay. Thank you, God. Soccer team back in the day. Okay, yeah. Shout out to, what else is, what else, what else, what else, what else? Do you guys know anything about Columbus? Just, uh, any? Nothing, man, nothing. Uh, large gay population. A lot of the Midwest gay folks. Really? But, uh, okay, that's great. Let's go, baby. Are like, mm, I'm not going to San Fran. I'm staying Midwest. Durs always keeps okay, tabs of mid specifically go. Midwest gays. That's that's what Durs is always, uh, he keeps a finger on the pulse. Yeah, well, I was raised by one, so you know. <laughs> cool, you, man. You know what's happening. <laughs> yeah, yeah, man. Um, yeah, nicely done, dude. Nicely done. We like that. What, what, what? What else? Where, else, where else is gay? <laughs> I think Minnesota had, a, or Minneapolis has a pretty good uh, gay community. G gay scene? Yeah, many, they call it many, many ass. <laughs> mm. Mm. Many. <laughs> Ma men and ass. Mm, we, many ass, and please. My lips. I guess you guys got yes, some points. <laughs> <laughs> I think they call Minneapolis. This man's ass is on my lips. And then we're going to uh, Indianapolis. Mm. <laughs> Which they Which call <laughs> in the uh, so. Indy my ass, please. <laughs> yeah, right. There we go. Yeah. Uh, right, good yes, stuff. points. Oh, that gets <laughs> points, Adam. Well done. <laughs> Indianapolis. I've only been there for a uh, NCAA finals game, uh, Wisconsin Badgers, when they got stomped by Duke or somebody. Okay. So everybody Fucking wear Duke. your Duke jerseys to that one. I know the restaurant we're going to go to. It's called like <laughs> Get Your Duke Jerseys On. <laughs> Elmo's and it's got a famous shrimp cocktail that I is love just it. oh god damn famous for being super spicy and that's it oh my favorite part about uh being on tour mm. is having really fun dinners with my friends. Mm -hmm. So I'm yep. really excited for, for that. Yes. It's going to be uh, half the podcast every time. It's like, <laughs> so the dinner we had tonight. <laughs> we but we're going to have to eat dinner at like 4 p.m. Uh, <laughs> yeah, we're going to <laughs> throw up on yeah. stage every night. <laughs> that's perfect. Honestly, that's that's yeah. perfect for me. I like to have a good. Yeah, for Ki for Kyle, that is perfect. I yeah. love a nice little first bell. <laughs> Kyle, is that a pickleball shirt, Kyle? Huh? <laughs> Yes. Is that a pickleball shirt? Well, yeah, low key. Good, good job, man. You got it. Yeah. Well, I'm a visual nice. learner, so you got it. Yeah, yeah. It's a... and you are looking, Kyle. Uh, Durst said before the podcast, and uh, I'm I'm oh, clocking it now, go. Kai guy. You're looking yeah. real skinny, bud. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, thanks, thanks. Yeah. How many lbs have you dropped? Freaking see ya. I was not complimenting him for the record. I was just as a scientist <laughs> noticing. Yeah, he wasn't complimenting. He he said, <laughs> Ooh, you look you look skinny." <laughs> yeah. I was yeah. like, the thing looks skinnier. Uh, I like it, though. I like it. You're giving real... Thanks, thanks. David Bowie vibes. <laughs> Your oh, boots are huge. baby. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> you look like a corpse. Um, yeah, I'm, but I'm, I'm a little concerned about the hair in the back is giving Why? me like Bill Murray end of uh, Kingpin vibes. Kingpin, yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. <laughs> I got it. That's I got it just kind of tucked up back there. You know, it's so fucking Very hot, man. I got to put it off my neck. Yeah. It's like it's gets. My man has a man nest back there. <laughs> gets so damn hot on the neck. I don't know how the hell you operate for so long, boy. Oh. I mean, come on now, dog. My my friend, I've had so many days when I wish I could just end it. <laughs> you can. You can just cut it. Yeah. yeah. You just yeah. shave it off. Yeah. But this is, it's like a little bun thing back here. It's cool. It's nice. It's nice. And yes, I am. Okay, but we're not talking about, yeah, we're talking about how you. Well, you were talking about that. We're going to shave both their heads when we get to what city, Adam? <laughs> when we go to, uh, I feel like yeah. that's a Louisville. A Louisville thing. Oh my God. I'm d I'm down below 220. I'm, I'm below 220, guys. It's a big, oh. big deal. Big deal. Yeah. Uh, that's huge, man. Wow, congrats, bud. And how many how many LBs did you drop, do you think? And have you been I mean, actively trying or you're just playing pickleball? Or in 220, he lost 220. I've been just 
playing pickleball and running. Beats like now, pizza. I'm running again. But okay, so you are you are attempting to lose mm-hmm. some some lbs. What shoes are you running in? What are you running in? I have been. Yeah. Yeah. I'm running in Hoka's, dude. Okay. I'm running in the in the. Which ones? What's on feet? Clifton's. They got the fucking wide ass base. Do you know what I'm talking about? Like really, really it's, wide. Like they go yeah, out. It's really Clifton's. I mean, that's a lot. That's most Hoka's. Yeah, they got the fat base, but I like mm-hmm. them. I think they're uh, they're good. I dig them. Yeah, good. Um, yeah. My uh, doctor called me fat yesterday, so that's that's cool. I feel like I need to. Uh... Was this while he was mm-hmm. peering into your asshole? <laughs> he didn't even call you by name. He just yeah. said, "Step in, fat." Hey, hey fat. <laughs> take a seat. <laughs> it's good to see you. I'm reading your file here, Chunk. What do you mean? What do you stop what do talking, you mean? fat? Sit down, fat. <laughs> he said I'm overweight and I need to keep an eye on it. But doesn't he know what As your situation is? <laughs> oh, <laughs> he's, he's like, eating. it's real fat back here. What's going on? Uh, Just your butthole. Yeah, it's hard to. It's really hard to part. I gotta grab it. No, he does know. He does know, and he understood. He's like, uh, <laughs> your butthole has sleep apnea. <laughs> <laughs> when, you, when you fart, you almost die. Yeah, well, I'm having hip surgery. I'm having hip surgery tomorrow. So uh, oh hopefully that clears it up and I can. Uh... These hips don't lie. Oh, you could probably got a. You probably got a fast tonight, huh? You got fast. No eating. <laughs> oh, no. Sorry. Uh, Friday. So today's Wednesday. So I can eat like a fucking pig. <laughs> well, that's going to be why your doctor's calling your names, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you are not fat. I eat because Stop I'm on Get a new doctor. Whenever I hear stuff like that, I just get a new doctor. This bro got the. Sh- <laughs> yeah. You're like, get, just get a brand new doctor. I just can't. I agree. I agree. I can't get over the sleep apnea machine hooked up to your butthole. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you can. He's a visual guy, just like me. And, just like uh, the pod. Uh, yeah. yeah, so I'm proud of, proud of you, Kai. Guy. Going out Thank there running. I didn't know you were a runner. That's fucking awesome. Uh, yeah, yeah, trying to shed it. It's uh, you know, it's important. I am also too big. What's cool about I'm I'm jealous of runners. It's <laughs> it's fun. We're gonna go to all these different cities. You can take a, oh. a hot lap. Yeah. We're going to do it, boys. And go see the city real quick, you know? Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's oh, do- yeah. We got to do it. Maybe maybe I'll be back. Maybe I'll run for the first time in my life with my new ass hip. In Indianapolis. Or just get one of those racing wheelchairs where you just get the gloves and you're right. Oh, that's cool. I'll push you. I'll- well, that's what's going to happen. I'm just going to be <laughs> fucking thick with it. Yeah, you'll lead the way. <laughs> oh, that <laughs> would be care. tight. Just all up here. I'm going to look like the uh, the... <laughs> The wheelchair guy from American Dad. You know who I'm talking about? Yep. The yeah. Just all up cop, body. That's going to be Cop dude. Yeah, he's yeah. sick. Did the you co- see that? <laughs> you saw one episode of that show? <laughs> the, the, the cartoon? <laughs> yeah, the cartoon American Dad, yeah. right? <laughs> yeah, it was, I, I, me and Blake were on a handful of episodes of uh, American Dad. We were? Yeah, me too. Yeah, you would go in for like a 30-minute session in that one room. We we recorded together. Or was it me and you, Durs, that recorded together? I would. I don't think it was me. Maybe it was. I remember going back there. They're like, hey, yeah. they want you for another voice. And I was like, I'm getting $10 for this. This doesn't seem right. Hey, that's why yeah. we're striking. Mm, that is a strike. <laughs> was it? Oh, because they play it so much. No, actually, we got we got good residuals for that because it was on uh, It was on because they play it so much. So American Dad was a great, wow, great gig. Wow, dude. So what are residuals? <sighs> Yeah. Back when um, residuals were programmed in, baby. So Louisville, Kentucky. I, I don't think I've ever been to Louisville. Louisville. Uh, we got to get Kyle in the batting cages there, right? Let's go. I'll hit a slugger. I'll use. Yeah, dude. I'm a, I'm excited for yeah. that. I have an aunt That'd that lives fun. in Louisville that I would love to link up with. That'd be cool. Louisville. Louisville. Uh, yeah. Well, you're gonna have to learn how to say it. Uh, Louisville. <laughs> Louisville. I think it's pronounced Louisville. Okay. Uh, okay. It okay. is. It's Louisville. <laughs> and the next destination on the tour is. You think it's pronounced Louisville? Louisville. People do say Louisville. Louisville. Yeah, Louisville. Louisville. Yeah, when they're drunk and slurring. It's like when you say. It's pronounced Louisville. It's true. Thank you, Todd. Yeah, but like when you say railroad, it's the same kind of thing. It's Louisville. <laughs> Don't say railroad, dude. It's Louisville. Yes, you do. Can you guys back me up? He says. So I say railroad. You guys sound like Louisville. You just said railroad, but you say railroad. <laughs> Adam says railroad. I yeah. don't say uh. railroad. Adam says my dad. My dad worked for the railroad. <laughs> yeah, he does say that. And yes, he does. Dude, my dad says it too. He was he was born in Missouri, uh, much like yourself. <laughs> he Adam also says Adam also says sugar. <laughs> 
Trigger. <laughs> Trigger and Devorist. Yeah, and Devorist. Let's what else? What else? What else? Well Durst says <laughs> thanks. He does say thanks. Durst definitely says thanks. Yeah. yeah. Hey. Thanks. Seems pretty cool to me. Thanks. And he always clears his throat like this. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> okay. Hey. So we'll we'll be in Louisville. And I say and I say things correctly, Louisville. And Blake says Blake says didn't. Or yeah. no, he says didn't. I say a lot yeah. of dumb shit, but <laughs> I didn't. I didn't go there, and you're like, I didn't. I didn't uh, go there. No, no, didn't. Didn't. That's ba- that's a Bay didn't. Area thing. You guys want to get it? Yeah, I get it. I didn't. Which is not on the tour dates, but stay tuned for the second half. Hey Blake, why do you hate the Bay Area so much, and you didn't make sure <laughs> that it's on the first leg of the tour, dude? It seems like whoa. Blake and Kyle hates the Bay. That's what. Whoa, whoa, chill, chill on, chill yeah, on dude. their boy. Fucking check, check your fizz level, dude. Hey, no. You know, it's like. <laughs> that's what. Uh, yeah, bro. That's what the comments your... are saying. <laughs> it, you guys are just as bad as these Texas kids. Come on. You need to have a little patience. We're doing a big fervor? rollout. Wait till the. Dude, we're second. trying to build fervor. Fervor hits. Here comes yeah. the fervor. Gosh. Dude, get fervorous. Get fervorous in the compliment section. Trying to build fervor. And then, and then we're going to fur burger, fast and fervorous, <laughs> hot Atlanta boys. Oh, that's gonna be a fun one. Oh, you it's know gonna Atlanta's go gonna be a banger. I yeah, we we know a couple spots out there. Oh, it's probably gonna be. I can't wait to be there for nine hours. <laughs> yeah. That shit's. We're gonna work. soak it in. <laughs> that's what I was kind of wondering. Oh, you can get a lot done in nine hours oh, yeah. in Atlanta. Trust me. Yeah, you spent a lot of time in uh, in Atlanta, Blake, when oh, you were yeah. shooting mm-hmm. uh, Woke. Yes. A, when I was there shooting uh, The Outlaws, every yes. place I would go into, they're like, "Your boy Blake was just in here." <laughs> oh, and like, I'm like yesterday, <laughs> two years ago. Yeah. <laughs> Been home for like months. Yeah, yeah. I leave uh, a steam. They're like, oh, they're, they're like looking around for you as if you just <laughs> left. They're like, he was just here. <laughs> Oh. Like, and I'm not joking. That happened multiple places. I'd walk in and they're like, oh, your boy was just here. And I'm like, who? And they're like, Blake. And I'm like, Blake has been home for like three months. Yeah, you don't understand. Was, Time freezes at this at this Jimmy John's. <laughs> it wasn't Jimmy John's. It was it was every bar I went into. So it made me go, oh, Blake, yeah. Blake had a good Blake had a good time here. Literally one of the coolest places you can ever go is the Claremont Lounge. It is such a cool bar. It it yeah. rocks, dude. Uh, I I went there. Uh, th- well, I've been there several times since. But the f- when I was shooting the Outlaws, we went there, and I had only been there one other time before that. And oh. I walk in, and the uh, the woman who's like in charge, the bartender uh, lady, she was like, "Oh, hey, honey, uh, I saved your seat for you right here, baby. Sit on down. Uh, good to see you, Adam." And then people are like uh, looking around as if I come in there all the time. This woman was just like remembered me, called me out as if I'm a uh, like I have a seat. And then everybody was like, "Oh, do you come here all the time?" And I'm like, "No." I mean, you're famous. Allegedly. I've been here one other time, which well, that was very nice of her. Yeah, dude, they're very welcoming. Yeah, she made me feel at home. But yeah. do you think me- it's a combination of a nice person and and you're famous? <laughs> wow, could it be? I do, I do think that, but uh, but I and. A combination of that and a little combination of. But it's please it's a strip club, the, so you don't, don't the, you don't want to feel like. <laughs> don't. Bop, 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 bop. I felt like she was outing me. Ready, dude. When in fact I hadn't been there before, sure. or like I've only been there one other time, like a year and a half previously. You thought it was a real right because. So it was a, it was a little off putting, but uh, it is an amazing place. <laughs> There's a woman there with uh, tits down to her knees and you throw your empty beer can up to her and she will smash the beer can between her titties. So uh, that's the kind of cool place it is, so. Whoa, that's tight. Sounds yeah, like a must. Yeah, that's, um, no, it's really yeah, it's, fun. It's a must It's see. really fun, it's a great spot. Let's, let's see, I guess I was there for Junior Nationals in 1998, but. Uh, no, and you didn't go to the Claremont Lounge. It's a blast. Did not, I went, I went somewhere though, where they had like. We gotta go to JR Crickets. Um, she crushes the beer, a 
30 different mixed ice drinks or whatever in those machines, you know? Mm. She she crushes Oh them. yeah, this all the And I dropped my fake ID and got one. Ooh, mm. all the daiquiri, the hot daiquiri spots. Mm. Ooh, yeah, exactly. I've always been cool. I got a question. I got a question about the boobs yes. thing. Mm -hmm. oh. Be between <laughs> It's the... science. The breast? She crushes the can? Yes. Yeah, so she would take her titties. Yeah. So you know how you grab uh... <laughs> like this, like this. Here, I'll, I'll, I'll. The so imagine you're grabbing butt cheeks. <laughs> Visual. <laughs> so uh, watch, watch me here, Kyle. So yeah, I'm watching. Yeah, Adam is okay. now. He's got his. He's pretending like he has one tit mm -hmm. in each hand. Yeah, he has his titties in his hands. Oh, you're, you're, whoa. Oh, no way. Oh, she throws the can into the air and then. Whoa. Whoa! So you throw the can up, and then she takes her giant titties and goes, uh huh, and catches them. <laughs> it's science. Whoa! Really? Smashes the can in between her giant titties. Oh my gosh! Yeah, dude, I'm so dude, Kyle, you got it. So they're recycling. I it, love it. It's it's worth the price of admission. You're like, that yeah, that was I. How do how are her? Yes, even if you're not a drinker, get a soda pop and enjoy the show because it is a blast. Enjoy the show. It is it is fun. And there's great clientele. But so her breasts are so firm at that size. Uh, they also have like a the old the world's oldest stripper. They have like a 80 year old woman up there. Yeah. Does she cut yes. herself? It seems like. It. <laughs> Sorry, is this a strip club or a bar? It's, it's honestly. Both. What is this? It's a bikini bar. Okay. Okay. But it's only like. Yeah, it's not like intense it, or anything. It's just like yeah. a vibe. Well, it's a, it's a, it's it kind of a, it's a scene. It's a scary, scene. A yeah. little bit scary, like a little bit, like I'd be like a little nervous when you go in there. It's like Cha Cha Lounge meets like a Jumbo's it, Clown Room. But wasn't what was the bikini bar downtown yeah. Cheetahs LA that was there forever? Cheetahs? No, 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 no. That's Hop, Hoff's Brow. Yeah, Mike's Hoffbrow. That place rocks. Sam's. Yeah. Sam's. Sam's. Sam's Hoffbrow. Yeah. You call it Mike's because our boy Mike is, was the shining light. <laughs> Table for Mike. <laughs> Table for Mike. Dude, just, we would jump the line straight to the front before. It, it was called Sam's, but that was Mike's place. <laughs> before fame and whatever, like just going straight to the front of the line and he would go, uh, I got a table for Mike. And you just said it with such confidence and you just want to, you just want this dude in your club. Yeah, yeah. And then they just waved us all in and yeah. had a table for us. And we were dude, like, I hung out with uh, Mikey last night. We went and got sushi downtown in. Uh, oh, yes. Old Japan town, which I did not know was a thing in Los Angeles, but mm -hmm. it is. And it's fucking yeah. awesome down there. That yeah. sounds right badass. On, yeah. Uh, and then. I'm so jelly. I'm so jelly now, I'm bitch. Jelly. After we get wild in Hotlanta, we're going to be sick. Kind of cool off a little bit and maybe Ooh. chill out because we're hitting Salt Lake City. Oh. SLC, baby. Oh, very Utah. psychedelic. Mm. SLC punks, dude. We're going to get very punk rock out there. Yeah. Is that where the beers are? The beers are limited in SLC, right? Like the percentage of it? Yes. It, what does that mean, mate? Like, we're going to learn the protocol. We're going to talk about it on stage, I'm sure. It means the percentage. Less less percentage of alcohol. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like three and a half percent or something like that. Uh, yeah. Three two beers or whatever. Is that less than like a Bud Light is? Bud is yes. five. Yeah. Bud Light's like five. Because that's all I drink. Yeah, of course. Well, yeah, well, that's going to be three and a half percent Bud Lights, bud. What about the Buzz Balls? Okay, but you're hydrated. I love it. Yeah, you're if just going to drink more. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's still water. Still water. The Buzz Balls. What if I bring in super strong Buzz Balls across the border? Do you think they'll find you? <laughs> oh, I don't know if you can do that. I don't know if you can import, dude. Yeah. <laughs> I think you'll be arrested on the spot, and I would love that. I think this tour <laughs> isn't a success unless specifically Blake is arrested. <laughs> Fuck it. Right. And wait what? for Buzz Balls in. So <laughs> is this Church of Latter Day Saints? Who's in the? Who's Donate. in Salt Lake? Yeah, it's. Uh, I think it's uh, Mormon country. It's Mormons. Yeah. Is that the same thing as Church of Latter Day Saints? Yes, mm -hmm. I believe so. Yeah. And what is Latter Day? Yesterday. I don't know. It's uh, tomorrow. As I'm saying. Like uh, Latter Day was just like in the <laughs> 60s or whenever when the Mormons created this religion. Yeah, the latter day. The latter day. Latter day like, yeah, is it like, like Saturday? Is it Saturday? Well, no, it was, it, I, 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 someone should look it up, but it wasn't that long ago. It was like Saturday. Church of Saturday Saints. Yeah. <laughs> it was like John Henry, right? Did it? And John Smith. John Smith. John Smith. John Smith. He found yeah. some like golden plates that said like 
this shit is important and it was yeah. <laughs> like, oh, okay <laughs> respect <laughs> well that's uh, that like religion's important. a naked grandma and everyone's like Burton. our whole entire podcast has been leading up to this moment we're leading people towards the Mormon yeah, the church. church of latter-day saints <laughs> yeah. which admittedly Saturday. out of all the saints like latter-day ones are kind of tight because mm -hmm. you like yeah they rock you might have known one of them what is latter-day right dude? yeah dude you, <laughs> yeah. my uncle was a latter-day yeah. saint what the f Latter day, that, that's when you clean the gutters? What are we talking here? <laughs> Thank you. Well, Latter day chores? Hey, Latter day's for the boys. Okay? <laughs> Latter day. <laughs> they, hey, I will say. Usually... Latter day's for the boys. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. Blake, if I don't get goddamn points uh, for that sorry, one. Sorry, yeah. man. <laughs> the, you can... <laughs> Jesus. Uh, and I feel like we need to make Latter yes, Days. <laughs> You're leading the league in points today. Merch. Latter Days for the boys. Merch. Latter Day is for the boys. Merch yeah. for as for... Salt Lake City. Yeah, that's a really good idea. Isaac, God, fuck good. that up, please. I've done shows in Salt Lake City before. Uh, and Isaac, it says Later Days. They are great. Yeah, no, I can't wait. Yeah. Uh, they were very fun shows. Later Day. Uh, Seattle. And we're ending the first leg of this tour in... Beautiful Seattle, Washington. Adam Ray. Starbucks. I cannot wait. Get your Joel McHale and Adam Ray on. Maybe those are our guests. <laughs> no, Ken Griffey Jr. will not be there. Dude, Sean that Kemp. would be sick. Come on, baby. Love Ken Griffey. You know, I met Ken Griffey Jr. just a few weeks ago. How was he? He was telling me. He, he, was, he, he said the nicest things about you. Mm. Uh -huh. Is it real? That's cool. Adam's. He rocks. Adam's getting uh he's playing brick breaker. A Adam goes, Yeah, I met King Griffey Jr. <laughs> Let me be on my phone for a moment. You guys discuss that thing I said for a no, second. Matt's Matt, Matt. Jeez, cool. man. Jeez. Matt's in the market was a restaurant we're gonna go to when we are in Seattle. It was so damn good. It was called Matt's in the Market. No, Sparrow. I'm going to Sparrow. Matt's in the Market. Kyle, what is Kyle doing? And uh, Joel McHale took me there after the... Uh... I want Kyle's attention. I want your undivided attention for what Adam's talking about right Goodbye. now. Goodbye. You're not invited. Joel McHale took me there after... Uh... I'm bored, dude. <laughs> after the... <laughs> I'm fucking, this is boring. MLB celebrity all-star game. Right, yeah, you were saying <laughs> that it was off the charts. Um, yeah, it was and, really and good. Which Max. to me, valuable information. Kyle on the other hand, I don't know if he's fucking picking toe jam out of his feet or what over there. What are we I'm doing? I'm listening, dude, I'm listening. I'm just looking <laughs> down. I don't have to look at you. I was. What's boring? You think this is any more exciting than any other episode we've ever done? You want his attention, you gotta talk about, you want his attention, I'm... you gotta talk about buttholes. Yeah, what the? That really hurts my feelings, Kyle. <laughs> yeah, he's what, gonna we tune in. Weight Look, loss again? If we're not talking about jerking off, Kyle's <laughs> checked out. Yeah, if it's not sexual, I'm kind of like, well, all right, I'll. You're nasty. Well, I'll just wait. I'm just, <laughs> I'm patiently Dude. waiting. I'm, I'm not interrupting. I'm patiently waiting and chirping in when I feel like I can chirp in. <laughs> no, I'm watching you. I don't like it. Well, guess what? When we. When we go to dinner at Matt's in the Market in Seattle yeah. to uh -huh. end the first leg of the tour, mm -hmm. you can excuse yourself and go jerk off in the bathroom, Kyle, because I know I'm you really have to do that. Happy to. Happy to. Oh, and I'm excited for you to jerk, because I use those restrooms. I'm happy that you're happy. I use those restrooms. It's They're nice. They're clean. Tell and us. I think you'll enjoy jerking off in them. Okay. Happy. I'm happy. Now I'm okay. in. This is great. Now I have right. something to look forward to. Oh, now he's into it. Huh. Oh, good. Oh, yeah, that's great. Right we're going we're gonna to try and get Kyle to gain all the way back on this tour. Oh, that's easy, man. Dude, I'm probably, I'm probably going to be <laughs> my fattest self because I'm getting the hip surgery and I can't that's work exciting. out. Uh, yeah, I think I'm going to break the 200 barrier, which I've never done before. <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh, man, I kind of remember you in an era when you were got close before because I remember yeah. talking about this. And, and and rooting for you, rooting for you to get there. It's been a lifetime goal. Yeah, I usually, I eb, I ebb and flow. Yeah, I eat because uh, I'm unhappy. So I think I I think I'm probably gonna hit it. Uh, you know, it's just I'm not gonna be able to work out or really move for a few weeks. Mm -hmm. Where Where are you at right now, brother? Yeah, what, how far on? do we have to go? I think yeah. I'm a, I, I weighed myself at the doctor's yesterday and I was mm -hmm. 194 pounds. So I got okay. six pounds. Oh, yeah. Oh, dude, you're a couple, you're a couple meals away. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, that's half cock. 
Um, mm-hmm. Dude, you're rock, you're rock solid. A couple garlic breads, you're good, dude. I don't think you're fat unless when you sit on the toilet, your stomach like yeah. touches your thighs. Whoa. Yeah, that's when you know that. That's when you know it's it's bad news. That's when you're fat, right? Okay. I was thinking about that the other day because I was like, uh, at least my stomach's not touching well, my thighs. Yeah, and I'm not quite there. I'm not. I'm not quite there, but it's yeah, wait, fine. it's drooping a little bit. Wait. More than my stomach. My stomach doesn't really droop, mm-hmm. and uh, it's starting to droop. You come from a barrel chest or a barrel tummy family. Yeah, where does your th- where does your thigh start? How far do you lean forward when you where, poop? when you poop? It, are you like back? Back to the just a standard, dude. It's a standard. Well, you're not. No one shits the fucking. <laughs> don't no, say no fact, one. In don't fact, say you no don't one. lean against the back seat. No, 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 you no, never, no. You don't you sit. Forward. You sit straight up. You sit straight my, forward. My toilet has a fucking recliner, dog. Yeah, I, 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 I do this. I take a Woo. shit like I'm in a low rider. I'm like way back here, like oh just like a fucking... What the fuck, dude? That's a dude. trip, bro. <laughs> See, oh my god, I where does a... it go? <laughs> low rider. See, I hate when Blake makes up things for the pod. I I want realism when it comes to our podcast, not like just making <laughs> stuff up. You don't uh, know. You never see me shit. Especially about, I agree. I agree especially about this kind of thing. <laughs> agree, because it's like we're at. Hey, you don't know where I put my, those cameras, Blake. Because my question is, where do your thighs technically start? You know what I mean? Like if. It, <laughs> oh, you're saying thighs to at stomach? The hip. <laughs> I don't know, to each their own. I don't know. Good question. You know what I mean? <laughs> so, so Kyle, you're just admitting that you're you're for sure your gut for sure rests on your thighs. Is that what you're? I'm asking no. where the thighs start. I did not say anything except for like this dude is like at the hip. Where it bends. Sometimes my knees are uh, touching my nipples. I don't know. <laughs> the hip? At the hip? Like right where it bends? Yeah, Kyle. Yeah. Well, if I'm leaning forward, it can touch. <laughs> well, yeah. If you're leaning all the way over, sure. But like... Yeah, anybody. Yeah. No, if I'm just taking a shit. If you're trying to suck your own dick on the toilet, for sure. Yes. <laughs> if, if you're just sitting straight up... Don't do it while you're shitting. And your gut touches your thighs. <laughs> I agree with Durs. That is when... You're you're a little loose in the cage, brother. Well, mm-hmm. how far do you sit forward? Okay, well, so mine is mine is mine is touching the thigh. Mine's touching the thigh. My <laughs> my belly is touching the thigh. Yeah, Kyle, I think you are. I think a, a good doctor would tell you that you are obese. I think a good doctor would let you know that. Right, but I am proud us? of you. I think I can look that up on the internet, buddy. I don't need a doctor for that. I can look that up online. I know that. Okay. But I'm proud of you. You you nice. recently lost how much how much weight? Did we cover that? It's been a long time, but I was—I said I was up to two seventy like two years ago. And you're you know? at two twenty. I'm at two. I'm at two eighteen. Yeah, but who's counting? Who's nickel and diamond? You know yeah. what I mean? Wow, yeah, that's great, dude. I mean, wow, that's really good. That's fifty yeah. pounds. That's fucking incredible. Yeah, I was too big. I was because uh, you really could have. That makes me want to gain fifty to lose fifty. You really could have turned that corner and been. You could have got to three hundred. Oh, dude, was I was amazing. there. I was absolutely there. Like you I could have. Well, you're thirty pounds. That's yeah. like right there. You pussy it out. And I would love you like that. <laughs> but it would have been easy. You know what's weird about being 270 is I didn't even feel 270. I kind of felt sure. like I was like, all right. And then like, I got on the scale. Did your calves get huge? Is that, you know how like <sighs> X fat dudes have like oh, yeah. the Giant. most lit calves? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. The calf game is strong. No, I didn't get any of the. Like you can know you're like, you're, you were fat. And they go, yeah, I was fat. Yeah. You used to be fat. Yeah. That's a tell. I, didn't, I don't think I got any of the benefits. I don't think I got any of the benefits of being that big. Of you use. Know? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It wasn't. It's just the calves. There's no other benefit. <laughs> well, that's what's. Besides sick bowling shirts. They look great. They look really good. <laughs> oh, yeah. Fire shirts. Well, I feel a lot of fat guys, like, they are really strong because you kind of have to be strong to lug around all that weight all the time. All the time. So, like, you have to be. Yeah. Oh, for days. And your heart for days. is in shape <laughs> for days. So then they lose they lose a ton of weight and then they're just like kind of jacked, stacked dudes. And you're, you're kind of like, is that the trick? Well, sometimes, like, when I went. That's what I'm doing. It's my. <laughs> jacked and stacked with just, like. The skin situation, yeah, but for yeah. sure. It is so wild when you lose Boy. that much weight and then you just pick up like a couple bowling balls and you're like, dude, this used to be on me. Like, you know what I mean? Like, that's uh, a sure. lot of right. fucking weight, bro. Sure. It's yeah. wild. Well, more than a couple, yeah. 50 pounds. I yeah. mean, bowling balls are like 50, yeah. Yeah, bowling balls are like 10 or 12 pounds. 50 pounds is like four bowling balls, right? Like four, yeah, four bowling balls. I lost four bowling balls. <laughs> yeah, that's a I'm lot a dude. of dude. 
a couple dozen bowling balls. <laughs> it's incredible, actually. Man, yeah. big ups to me, dude. Good job. Let's go. That is, man. The human. Big up to the human body. Yeah. No, I'm proud of you. Good. Good work. And yeah. that's and mostly pickleball, pickleball related. So yeah, I, you know, thank. Hey. So shout out to Selkirk. Shout out to Big Pickleball. Shout out to Selkirk. Thanks for the yeah. paddles. Send my man a hat. Thanks yep. for the paddles. The hats. I need the net. Well, uh, are there any takebacks? Any apologies? They got to send me that net. I would love an apology from Kyle since he okay. sort of like zoned out when I was. <laughs> what did I do? Talking about <laughs> Ken Griffey Jr. and you just sort of. Well, you also decided if if it's. No, no, that's when that's when you zoned out. Adam. Yeah, I didn't zone oh. out during that. I was. <laughs> that's when you zoned out, bro. <laughs> Adam, that's when you zoned no, out. Was... I'll take that apology, <laughs> dude. I wasn't zoning out. I was looking up something to talk about on the podcast, dude. Matt's in the market. Uh... <laughs> yeah, but you yeah. started something. The restaurant we're gonna go to in Seattle. You still should apologize. <laughs> I just love this. It's. Uh, I met Ken Griffey Jr. I think I told you guys I met him a couple weeks ago. And then it was like, <laughs> I'm bored, you know? <laughs> okay. Well, you know what? I guess I'm not getting that apology and that's fine, dude. Yeah, no, I'll give you I'll that's give you a okay. moment of gratitude. Like, I fucking love you and appreciate you. You know what I mean? How about that? Hey, mm. thanks, dude. Yeah, thanks. Hey, All I right. love that. And I love and appreciate you guys. Uh... That's really nice. That's really nice of you. Any take backs or moments of gratitude? Uh. <laughs> Oh. We're gonna add moments of gratitude. I like and, that. Uh, give you a moment of gratitude. I like that too. I would. This is a moment of gratitude presented by Latter Day Saints. <laughs> gratitude. Latter Saints. Days for the boys. <laughs> Get your merch on. We're for sure not gonna have it. Latter Day. Latter Days for the party. boys. That's really good, dude. Get your tickets at tiitour.com. That is tiitour.com. Yeah. Do we get like vi like visors to be like backwards and upside down for because it's such a Saturdays for the boys thing to oh, wear? Latter days for the boys visors. Yeah, latter days is for the yeah. Oh, yeah. I kind of like that. But then if you have to wear it, you have to wear it back up upside down and uh, backwards in order to read it. So the font will be upside yeah. down. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. So you have to wear it backwards and upside yeah. down. Also, I can mm -hmm. pretty much guarantee we won't have this merch on the tour. So no. if anybody who's listening <laughs> no, wants no, no, to yeah. do this and sell yeah. it in the parking lot, I'll be buying uh, your merch. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Any? Yeah. Yeah. We might we might tune into that. You're way. going to hear from my lawyer. At, at the SLC show. I want all the bootleg merch. The I want all the bootleg merch. That's mm. for sure. Absolutely. We encourage it. Any take backs, any apologies? We are going to um, sell some merch. I'm excited to, uh, yeah, to finalize I mean, that. Oh, God. Yeah. Oh, God. I'm going to give a shout out. Shout out to uh, USA Swimming Foundation. Okay. And I did a game show. Yeah. And uh, I was happy to send them 25 Gs to teach some kids how to swim. We Good got to stop the drownings. Absolutely. Uh, if people watch that, that was a lit ass oh, app. And I'm, I'm saying lit. I'm saying yeah. lit now. Lit. Oh, cool. It yeah. was good. You guys, you guys crushed it. Celebrity family feud. Steve Harvey, baby. Uh, yeah, if honestly, if we could if we can talk about it, I watch a lot of family feud. That was an excellent episode. You guys were neck and neck. So you're just talking about you're promoting it. We're not. Yeah. Like I'm not a part of yeah. it. I have no stakes in the game. I would just love to say that that was an excellent episode of Family Feud. Yeah, thanks. Uh, I think the the families really did a great job of carrying the load. They did. They um, did. My dad was on a good one. Unbelievable. Um, yes. Your father you know, was very funny. <laughs> I love that your dad said Steve. <laughs> Adam and I just bl just blanking. Adam and I not knowing. We're like, we can't. I don't. Yeah. Dude, I could have mm -hmm. won the game if I would have just known Bob Barker. And I know Bob Barker, obviously. The spotlight was too hot. Yeah. Yes, he's in Happy Gilmore, yeah. dude. Come on. The price is wrong. Yeah, I know. I know, dude. Price is wrong, bitch. Did I tell you guys I uh, I met Bob Barker last week? Hang on a second. <laughs> I'm gonna come. <laughs> um, let's see. Um, a have... real banger, and you got ten, you got to send hey. ten G's to um... the Children's Miracle Network hospitals. Uh, for it, it's just a, a a group of children's hospitals. So and we're not so gonna awesome. stop listeners yeah. from also contributing on yeah, their own. Feel free. That was the right. whole yeah, point. Free. Just to raise awareness. So you said they sent me this sick little zip up that I'll never wear. Did you say miracle or miracle? What'd you say? Miracle. Louisville. Mir Ooh. Children's Miracle Network. <laughs> miracle. I want to. If you love it, why don't you miracle it? You guys say miracle? Miracle. 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 I say miracle. It's... I say miracle. 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 Like Miracle Mile? Miracle. miracle. I say Miracle Mile. Miracle Mile.
That's what I was wondering. Ameri- That's tight, dude. <laughs> dude, we, this hey. is the dumbest podcast. The fact that we're going to go on tour is so silly. Come yeah. see us dumb That's live. Just, just, Come yeah. see us try and pronounce your city's name. Yeah, miracle, miracle, miracle. I would love to apologize to the great state of Texas and to the Bay Area, but please be patient. Stay tuned. That's it's funny how yeah, we are all out. Off the podcast, you keep saying how you like you do not want to go to the Bay Area. That's what's so funny to me. <laughs> no, it's it not. They're mean to me there. It's almost all. Yeah. Talks about we're roasted. Yes, yeah, so all you talk about is how you do not want to go to the Bay Area and fuck the Bay Area. We'll do it so. live. Yeah, you left there. Yeah, you left here yeah. for a reason. You're like, we're I got out there for a reason. Huh. Yeah, why would I go? He yucky, keeps yucky, saying, yucky. "Why would I go back?" Yeah, why would I go back? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, we're going to Texas. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Uh, well, we'll see if they're nice to us in the comments. Okay. That's right. Be nice in the compliments, everybody. Be nice yes. in the compliments. And That's that was right. another episode of Too Deep Cut. This is Please don't stop the music. 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 Please don't stop the music.